what's up, it's Ruby. Welcome to my world. Today we are doing a quick unboxing of an electric wine opener. So if you have been keeping up with my videos, you saw um, I broke my rabbit ear. I'll show you. Hold on. I broke my rabbit ear wine opener which I own for years and I've been intensively using it lately and it's just time to retire it. So sad. This is good. This is really good. Anyway, so I got one from Amazon. I'll link it down below. Check it out. It's by the brand Oster. Oster? Not Oyster. I kind of want an Oyster. Oster! <laughs> And uh, that's French. And uh, let's see, it easily opens up to 30 bottles fully charged. That's gonna be quick. <laughs> 30 bottles, not a lot. It's gonna be quick. Cordless operation with recharging base. Yes, so it has a base like this, like this, and it looks like that. Just sit on there like nicely. There's also a foil cutter. This is pretty good. And the foil cutter sits behind here. See? So it's kind of um, pretty small. It stands straight up. It's not gonna take a lot of space. And what else did I say? Stylish and ergonomically designed to soft grip. Blah blah blah. Okay, so I tried it, and here it goes. Go! So let's try this out as well. Um, if you are following my videos, I broke it last. I broke my old one last time. It's a rabbit thing. And I went online. I saw um, people are using electric stuff now. So let's give it a try. It comes with a uh, cutter for the foil. So let's try this out. Let's see. Okay, pretty good. Easy, easy. I like it. Okay, so my first time. It's supposed to be like no effort whatsoever. Just put this in, hold on to it, press the down button. That's it. When do I stop? Okay, it's tight now. The bottle was spinning, so I think I'm good to stop. I think. And then hold it and hold it tight, grip and press the up button so the screw comes up. That's what I think. Oh, wait. No? <laughs> it didn't take out the cork? What? Hold on, one more time. Okay. Am I doing it right? Right? Oh, okay. Let's see. I think I have to grip it tighter. And then... Do I pull? And then hold it tight. Hold it down. Okay, the cork is in there. So I, I took it out. I took it out. I just need to know, find out how to release it. Oh! <laughs> Alright, not bad! Alright! So, hold on, very important. Important, very important to replenish my thirst. So, when I first used it, it was a bit confusing. But now that I know that I have to grip hard and just move the screw down, like I have to put the bottle in just at the top and grip hard and just let the screw do its thing and it will come out and press, press the up button and it will come out so when I first tried the first time I didn't grip hard enough I didn't follow the instruction anyway, okay, um, I'll keep using it and I think it's pretty convenient and it's stylish and it's kind of like cool when you take it out and open it in front of a friend. Okay, alright. Thank you for watching. Follow me on Instagram. I post every day there. Subscribe for more wine chats and other useless silly chats. Oh, and I do music. Hit the bell button. Here, 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 here. And I'll see you in my next